Yes, I'm compartments which have not yet been cut open. But I think the first priority is to focus on saving lives and taking people out of the current situation over there. Uh, I want to applaud all of the local citizens and youth who responded immediately, come and help people walk away because it's not right next to the road. It's quite inconvenient to get here. Uh, it's very sad that uh, in this day of technology, well, I'm reading news that uh, it's because of lack of signal or lack of communication between the two trains. It may have been human error that may have caused this. Uh, very sad about how many lives uh, might have been lost. Uh, at this point, I don't want to comment on anything beyond, but uh, I just hope that the entire rescue forces and all of the private citizens who are here, private organizations, provide as much help as possible and save as many lives as soon as possible because uh, some of the compartments, I believe, have not yet been opened. And uh, that's what worries us because if they are already in a bad stage, a matter of seconds could save or lose lives. I, I express our condolences on behalf of the TDP party to all of the lives lost. Our uh, local uh, constituency in charge, Ms. Kolarit Kumari, was here about three and a half, four hours ago. And their team was one of the first on the site to identify and inform us all. And on behalf of the entire party, we have our leaders here uh, providing whatever support we can to the government and to the relief forces in saving lives. Sir, did you speak with officials what they are saying? No, at this point, I don't want to pressurize them. I don't want to get a post-mortem. I have asked them that you please focus on saving lives. What help you want? Uh, private organizations, for example, from our hospital also, we've got an ambulance and staff here just in standby if they need any help. Want any water, food for the rescue forces? We'll make it available. As you see, as you can see, the lighting is not very clear over here. Accessibility is not there, and we don't have any heavy machines that are able to reach this site immediately. So there is a major challenge, and they need to clear the lines because from tomorrow again there will be a lot of pressure on these lines for movement to happen. So, this is a very active and live situation right now. Repeat this kind of accidents, how can we see this? We, as a politicians, we always say that uh, this should not happen, blame the government and all this. The sad thing is, in today's era, we are speaking about artificial intelligence and 5G and 6G. It's unfortunate that a simple communication error or lack of communication, lack of signal is causing so many loss of lives. What you can say is, you feel very sad. And I believe many of the compartments that have fallen out are all general compartments. So, they are heavily populated. Uh, so, we worry how many bodies are there inside. Uh, I hope I hope not too many. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 जहाँ सूचना मध्य पूर्व आसुला जे कहुचे ट्रेन जहाँ डेंजरियस सिग्नाल रही था से सिग्नाल को अतिक्रम कर जो कि आज ये बड़ दुर्घटना घटी कि जदि आपन को आम भिडटे भल लगला तेब चेल को लाइक शेयर और सब्सक्राइब करने को जमा भी भूलु